How to enable code coverage in Visual Studio 2022. If you're working on a project and want to know how much of your code is being tested, enabling code coverage in Visual Studio 2022 is a great way to do it. Let's break down the steps to get you started. First, it's important to note that the built-in code coverage feature is only available in the Visual Studio Enterprise Edition. However, if you're using the Community or other editions, you can still use the Fine Code Coverage extension, which is free and highly effective. Using Visual Studio Enterprise Edition, if you have the Enterprise Edition, here's what you need to do. Open Visual Studio and go to the Test menu. Select Analyze Code Coverage for All Tests. You can also run code coverage from the Test Explorer tool window. After the tests have run, you'll see the code coverage results. To visualize which lines have been executed, choose Show Code Coverage Coloring in the Code Coverage Results window. By default, covered code is highlighted in light blue. To customize your code coverage settings, you can use a Run Settings file. Add a new XML file to your solution. Name it something like CodeCoverage.RunSettings and configure it according to your needs. For example, you can specify different formats like Cobertura or XML for the coverage data using Fine Code Coverage Extension in Community Edition. If you're using the Community Edition, you can install the Fine Code Coverage Extension. Open Visual Studio and go to Extensions, Manage Extensions. Search for Fine Code Coverage in the online extensions, select it, and click Download. Close Visual Studio to install the extension. Once installed, restart Visual Studio. After installing the Fine Code Coverage extension, you need to configure it. Open your solution and rebuild it to trigger test discovery. Go to View, Other Windows, Fine Code Coverage to open the Fine Code Coverage window. Run your tests, and the code coverage will be displayed in the Fine Code Coverage window. To exclude unit test projects from the coverage, go to Tools, Options, type Fine Code in the filter, select Fine Code Coverage, and set Include Test Assembly to False. Additional tips for both methods, it's helpful to optimize your code coverage settings. Turn off compiler optimization, use debug builds for unmanaged code, and generate PDB files for each assembly. These steps ensure you get accurate and detailed coverage results. If you encounter issues, such as not seeing any results, check for potential conflicts like specific DLLs interfering with the code coverage process. For example, the presence of Microsoft Visual Studio.TraceDataCollector.dll can cause issues in Enterprise Edition. By following these steps, you can effectively enable and use code coverage in Visual Studio 2022, whether you're using the Enterprise Edition or the Fine Code Coverage extension in the Community Edition. This will help you identify which parts of your code are being tested and where you need to write more tests.